Remember when Microsoft released Windows 11? It made it clear that a lot of old hardware won't be able to support it. People had no choice but to purchase a new device to keep using Windows and getting security updates. For others, they had to continue using the soon-to-be outdated Windows, which would soon stop receiving security updates, thereby leaving their data at risk. What if I told such people that other alternatives could serve and continue to keep their data safe? Here are four lightweight Linux distros that could revive your old machine and make it run smoothly without glitches. At number four, Puppy Linux. Puppy is a unique family of Linux distros meant for home users' computers with a bit more Linux. Experience. Puppy is optimized to boot live and ready to use as soon as you run it. This means you don't need to install it on your hard drive before you can use it. Puppy can be used on the go as it comes. It is pre-installed with basic tools for common daily computing usage, such as the Mozilla web browser, Claw's mail client, Abbey word processor, and Genumeric spreadsheet tool. It also contains graphic tools, multimedia tools, personal tools, games, etc. It also has a firewall tool for your protection. New users can get around things easily as Puppy is designed to include a lot of help and hints, making it easy to use. With its lightweight nature, it is designed to be super fast and versatile on many aging devices. Its configuration is not hard, and it can be done in minutes. Lastly, it allows you to save the session or not when you shut down so you don't lose your progress. Next on the list at number three is Bodhi Linux. With a minimal system requirement, Bodhi can make your aging hardware run like a champ and look cool. This distro is designed to be lightweight featuring the fast and fully customizable Moksha desktop. It has both 64-bit and 32-bit versions. The 64-bit is built on top of Ubuntu version 22.04. In contrast, the 32-bit has an 18.04 version Ubuntu base. Bodhi as an open source distro feature comes pre-installed with basic apps such as Chromium web browser, ePhoto for picture editing, notepad, etc. It also has an app center that contains curated software, themes, and icon sets for desktop styling slash customization. Bodhi Linux utilizes a live environment, which allows you to try it out before installing. This distro has three releases. You could start with the app pack release, which comes pre-installed with many useful apps. Be sure to note that any changes made in the live environment will not be saved. If you intend to save changes, check out Puppy Linux previously discussed or the lightweight distro coming up next. Coming up next at number two is Proteus, a distro that is not just lightweight, but also remembers where you left off. If you're familiar with live booting OS, you should know that it doesn't save your session after you turn off the system. But you don't need to be alarmed because Proteus is different. With Proteus, you can now fit all your jobs in a single USB flash drive which you can slot into any PC anywhere and at any time and do your work without stress. During download, you could select an image with a desktop of your choice ranging from Cinnamon, Gnome, KDE, Mate, XFC, and more. Finally, at number one, LXLE Linux. This Linux is a Linux distro built on the most recent Ubuntu slash Lubuntu LTS release. It features the LXD desktop as a default desktop environment. This distro is designed to be lightweight thereby consuming fewer system resources perfect for older hardware. It also comes pre-installed with all the basic software you need for daily activities. Installation is super easy it could take less than five minutes from start to finish. So far, you've seen the visuals of these distros. Why not try it out yourself to get first-hand experience? So, which among these distros have you tried before? What are you waiting for? All you have to do is to get a pen drive and check it out right away.
If you like my videos, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment so that I will keep uploading videos like this. Until next time, see you in my next video. Have a nice day.